This is my friend the fan. Welcome to the channel. Don't waste time and subscribe so you don't miss even one informative video that we post here daily. It just happened in the Browns took everyone by surprise. Cleveland Browns to release John Johnson 3 as part of maneuvering to create cap space. The one player who was always expected to be a potential cap casualty for the Browns is going to be won by March 15th. Now, the question is what other moves await to help the Browns free up enough space in order to improve the roster this offseason. General Manager Andrew Barry confirmed at the NFL Scouting Combine on Tuesday that safety John Johnson 3 is going to be released once the league year begins on March 15. The safety likely will be given a post-June 1st designation on his release, which would help the Browns save $9.75 million on the cap. After just looking at the roster and thinking about where we want to be in 2023, thought it would be the best move for the organization to really part ways, Barry said. But that certainly doesn't minimize what John was able to do while he was with our team. Barry expressed gratitude for what Johnson has done the past two years on the field and in the locker room for us. Johnson could be traded. However, the likelihood of that occurring is slim with other teams aware of the Browns' plans to let him go. Johnson was owed $9.75 million on the final year of his contract, although that money was not guaranteed. He carried a $13.5 million cap hit, which is why he was always seen as the number one candidate to get released in order to open up some room for the Browns under the cap. The Browns had previously restructured receiver return specialist Jakeem Grant's contract last week, creating $1.765 million in relief after it had originally been scheduled to be $3.56 million. However, there's an even bigger restructuring in the near future that Barry hinted needs to be done in order to make a real impact. Quarterback Deshaun Watson's deal jumps up to a $54,993,000 this season. It has been long assumed a restructuring of his original five-year, $230 million contract was forthcoming. Barry seemed to indicate Tuesday it was coming sooner rather than later. It could be on the table, but there's a lot of flexibility in terms of what we can do from a cap perspective, Barry said. Now my dear friend, tell me what you think about this negotiation for the Cleveland Browns, did you approve, yes or no? Have a great day and see you soon.